Thank you for tuning in this week. And so this week I will be having my husband. So basically I have ordered these Amazon nose piercers because I was gonna go to uh, I was actually gonna go to a piercer to get it done, but I decided against it. Because I did it once before, but like I don't have my uh my nose piercing like clothes up before. So we're going to do that today. I want to both. We can just do one a day and do the other one before I leave on my trip in a few weeks. So I want to have my husband help me do this. So, what you going to do? You going to post a clean on my nose? Yeah. We got to see what it's about. Use the alcohol pad to wipe the area. Make sure it's nice and clean. Which one? Which side of you? I don't think so because if you look on the like I know that's not my typical type of thing. I'm kind of want to do a vlog. I just got out of dance class um, with Miss Ashley. If you don't know who she is, and if you know, like, little Rocky, you know who she is because she's really out there and she does a lot of like backup dancing and things like that. I had one of her little dance class. It was like a she has heels and she does twerk. And then somebody else on her mutual song who does stripping, not stripping, but like pole dancing. And I had took her class today and I just realized like, uh, I love dance. That's something like I minored in when I was like in college, but I stopped mainly due to the fact of how like I felt about myself and my size and everything else. I just enjoyed this class because I love being able to try to get back into my comfort zone of myself. So one of these days I will post maybe a video of one of the classes or a snippet or anything, but y'all should definitely check her out if you're like local and want to see her. Like her Instagram will be in the bio. Um, but yeah, it's just, it was nice. She, you know, kind of gave some tips to how to feel comfortable doing things at home and then doing out in your like outer life. But yeah, this is one of the things I'm talking about me actually like trying to get back to myself and things that I enjoy. Um, I kind of let fear ruin my life and I did let it ruin my life and I realized something just in general like you can't do anything if you're fearful if you're worried so excuse the sweat but I do have more things on this vlog and see you then you guys clean up around it red oh. oh excuse me god that I had a bunch of anxiety on that one that actually is cute it actually came out and so I plan on doing the other side like right there oh you did a perfect angle too 
Ooh, wait. I'm an alien. Oh. <laughs> yeah, cause I'm... You gonna count me? Yeah. One, two, three. Oh! Yep. Both? One's black and one's... What you call it? That's crazy, ain't it? Yeah. How do it look? I think one is higher than the other one. No? Hold on. I can't see. I think you almost... <laughs> I think you did. Look, even to me. You see, I did have my husband do both. I believe it's really honest. Uh, I think it's even. I think it's cute. I've been wanting to get both sides already done, so I went ahead and did it. I have this problem being like fearful of everything so i was really trying to do something i've been wanting to do because look you're gonna see me do different things you're gonna see me do new things i don't know like go to our show or something like that but i know getting back into some, something that you love is really hard if you haven't did it in a long time and i just want to tell people like don't be fearful of all the things you're not gonna be perfect when you start it or whatever but you know as you perfect your craft and it's a gift you you will eventually get to where you feel so free doing it and it's about freedom and so yes i do want to also forewarn that some of it's explicit but that's the type of dance i was doing i was doing heels my first year of college i was doing heels i did and if you think of heels think of as a, you can think of cabaret if you want to but that's kind of the dancing that i enjoy i also like hip-hop i do like jazz i do like contemporary doing it but now i'm back doing it learning things i've never learned stance that you know is important and actually is a great teacher i should just take in her class if you can i will have her instagram in the bio and i will also put the link for the nose piercers that I use because also the piercers the piercing two of them I think this was like four nine on they came with piercings I can take out once they heal so I would suggest probably getting because literally like and it's a bunch of them took like seven piercings like little cute ones that you'll see Like, they look like these. Like, they have two. They have a hoop, which is really cute. They have a hoop one. Then they have, so this is the hoop. I really don't like these. I feel like they fall out. Just being honest. So this is the hoop. This is the, like, the little, um, little curve one at the bottom so it don't fall out. I like those better than I like the one that's like straight. The only reason why this one's last because I just have this big like needle point that you use when you um, did it. But then this was just regular. I personally like accessory jewelry like gold and silver but like the ones that's hanging on your nose. I personally like those. Like that's more of my style. I like those more centered ones. But here's like a basic that you can put in. So I think that would be cute. They got one up so hard. That's super cute. I don't like that. This, I don't know if you can see it. I'm trying to look y'all. Y'all can see this. This this camera making me mad now. I'm trying to do it, but y'all can't see that. Well, it's a heart. Look, there we go. It's like a little in and out. That's a heart. But yeah, those are the ones I got, so. Thank you guys for watching Unconventionally J. See you next week. I